Hello YouTube, this is Chesco from STEM APKs. Welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm gonna be continuing where we left off in part one of this tutorial. As you remember, in the last tutorial, we uh, configured the uh, OpenCV beta edition. In this tutorial and the next tutorial, we're going to be working with the contributors uh, directory and with the OpenCV extra. Uh, applications directory okay so I'm gonna be showing you how to get that in the other one so let's get started the first thing we need to do if you remember these were the these two right here are these two right here so after they've been extracted so now we're going to get this one and put it inside the one that we already built okay so what we're going to do we're gonna take this one and copy it and go inside the build directory and drop it in there okay that's all you need to do and now open a terminal and let's go into the build directory and as you can see it's right there okay so we're here right now okay so now what we're going to do is is build this one and if we don't know what to do all we need to do is follow directions that's all it tells you how to do it so you go in here and you go into the readme page right here and it tells you how to do it okay it's the same one right here so it tells you to go into the cd opencv build directory okay that's what we did we're here in the build directory so we did that part and then it tells us to do a CMake and then do that the flag and just copy nice and easy paste and then it tells you to give it a path to the modules directory okay so all you need to do is find the path to the modules directory don't copy that because that is not telling you anything this is a uh, you can make a mistake right here if you copy that so don't do that so just this is what they're talking about they want to go in there they want to go inside that directory and find the modules directory okay so you just let ubuntu auto complete for you by hitting the tab so all you need to do is open cv underscore contrib tab and ubuntu helped you there and then now find the modules m for modules tab and it finds it for you okay and now he's telling you he's telling you to do the give it the open wherever this open cv source directory is which in our case is just the parent directory which is this one the one on top right so all you need to do is just dot dot to go up one directory to the parent directory and all you need to do is that and hit enter and it's gonna hit enter uh, you you can hit enter I'm not gonna hit enter because I don't want to do it in here because I already did it here so you know how it is done I, I didn't want to take the time to do it so it's right here okay so you're gonna once you hit that is gonna build this one right here okay and it's gonna is these are the modules that are, is is getting to okay and the samples in python as you can see i've, I've been playing around with it already but uh and that's what you want okay so now that you do that all you need to do is just hit enter here and it's gonna build once it builds your be right here you don't need to do that because this is only if you if you don't want more than one I do not uh, recommend all you need to do here is to make and then the um, whatever j2 j3 you are j4 j5 after you hit enter here let's just hit enter um, enter and then control C to stop it and once you hit enter it's gonna go through the whole thing it's gonna show you what is configured if you're missing something just like we did in the first tutorial it's gonna do that 
and after it's all done and your configuration is done everything looks good all you need to do is make and then j whatever in your case in my case four and my j8 if you have eight it's up to you uh, it doesn't really matter okay and then just hit enter and it's gonna make uh the files okay and that is it that's all you need to do it's going to uh to configure everything inside this one right here uh, where is it it's gonna go in here and configure everything all the modules all everything and in the next tutorial we'll do the extras but let's test this one to make sure that it's working you saw already that I tested it but uh, let's get out to the to the one that I already have built is in CV downloads and open CV LS clear and then let's find uh, CV samples and let's do CV Python 2 and as you can see these are all the Python uh, no this is the wrong one this is the the traditional one this is not the contributors model so let's get out and get out this uh, we need to go into build because these are the ones that we, we, we build ourselves and let's go into the open CV contributors clear this is the one and we're gonna go into samples and then Python LS. and this is we're gonna do the video I already did the pictures but we'll do the video just to make sure that it's working correctly so you need to do we're gonna run this one P Python video Pi and you gotta give it a video to run and that's the one that comes with the with the file so you just do three avi and this is really fast so i gotta download uh, clear everything because it's going to be very fast and if you don't it's gonna be right here it's a video that he gary bratsky did for the for the learning cv book so let's run it and there you see it. you see it there it happens so fast that uh actually you can do other other things with it if you don't put a video api here let me show you if you don't put the uh, the three avi here it will do the video it will open the video on your if you have a web camera facing you it will start uh, showing your face there okay um so it's, it, you can do it that way or you can just run it with a video and and there's the video okay so we know that that's working and in the next tutorial I'll show you how to do the extra and uh, and uh, I'll also run some examples to make sure that everything is working uh, this is the end of the tutorial if you like this tutorial please click the like box and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next tutorial thank you